All right, I have a quick update about the uh, space bar on this keyboard. In case you don't know what I'm talking about, this is the Cosmic Byte GK18, the Automo Red version. I've been using it for a long time and I'm loving it. Uh, last time when we were trying to silence these switches a little bit more, we noticed that the stabilizers on these, uh, the space bar is not that great. So it was making a lot of uh, annoying sound. So I tried to contact Cosmic Byte officially and try and get a solution for it. So it turns out our theory is correct. The stabilizers are the ones that are making a lot of noise. But based on what I got from them officially, it seems like they can give me an alternate space bar with a newer design apparently. We'll get to that in a second. But they said that the sound would be the same. I mean that's a bummer really. They don't have any official solution for uh, improving the sound or uh, dampening the sound a little bit. If you remember I did add a foam inside this to reduce the sound and it did help with some of the keys but not the space bar. I've tried a bunch of things like making my own makeshift o-ring and things like that but uh, yeah it, it didn't really work out and most of the time I didn't like the feel that the key was giving me. Adding too much foam can actually ruin the feel of your keys so be careful in your attempt of uh, silencing the keys. I simultaneously also wanted to kind of check out how good is their service so I tried to contact them and yeah their service is actually quite nice they are very prompt in responding to you. And they gave me a solution that for 80 rupees I could order any 5 of these keys and uh, for the spacebar, uh, for the rattling issue, they said that they'll send me a new key. Great news, so I asked them to send me a picture of that key. Well, to my disappointment, it's the exact same key. And I was disappointed to see that uh, the keycap that they're sending is pretty much the same as the one that comes pre-built on the keyboard. Like that's the picture they sent me. And uh, this is the one that comes uh, installed on the keyboard when you buy it. So they're exactly the same. I mentioned that these extra uh, standoffs for the spacers may be causing that problem. And they said, uh, well, they didn't give me a clear solution. Because even the key that they're giving me as a replacement keycap, it, it still has the same uh, stabilizer extra thing here, which doesn't have a stabilizer standoff on the keyboard. So I have tried to kind of uh, loop these with the household items that we have and uh, tried to kind of dampen these uh, stabilizers with the uh, foam and stuff but yeah it didn't seem to work quite well. The only option that I haven't tried yet is a dielectric lube. You know the, the official lube that many people use for the stabilizers only that is left out now. But unfortunately as you can see these uh, stabilizers can't be removed from the board. Like they are properly fixed onto the board so I have to kind of desolder them from underneath as we saw in their teardown video all of these are soldered on. So I don't have the tools with me to disorder and replace them myself. The keycap that they are offering is a little bit different like the if, if the standoffs or maybe the shapes were a little different then I would have ordered and check it out if, uh, if the sound or the rattling would uh, improve a little bit. But I mean it's the same thing that they have sent me right so it's not gonna make any difference. So I didn't bother going through with it but at least I know that their service is pretty good now. So yeah that's a positive takeaway from this experience I guess. Everything else is pretty good about this as we have already discussed. The spacebar is the only place where the uh, keyboard shows its budget. I mean it's unfortunate that they decided to cut costs with the stabilizers instead of other places. Like to bring down the cost they could have made this as plastic instead of a metal plate. I don't think many people would have mind if the top plate was plastic instead of metal to save cost. But the stabilizers should have been a better quality ones. Some of you mentioned to me on Instagram that uh, the keys that you have seem to get stuck underneath. So that is actually an issue that you can solve with a better keycap. That's a problem with your keycap that you can replace with Cosmic Byte. But I don't have that problem. I just, I just don't like the sound. So there is no official solution for them. Yeah, I mean, that was just a quick update I wanted to share about the, uh, the warranty kind of experience that I had with their customer service. They're quite nice actually. They are very responsive. They get back to you on time. So they do take care of their customers quite well, which is always nice to see in a budget brand. So yeah, if you like these short update videos, then uh, leave a like. It helps me out more than you think. If I have any further updates, I'll be sure to let you know. So until then, uh, take good care of yourself and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.